A Haywood kid. With a hell of a drive. Rest easy, Tomb. I would like to say a toast. Or mi hijo. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be continuing Cyberpunk 2077. Uh, if you haven't checked the last one out, make sure you go and check it out. It was a, it was really interesting. Some things that happened that I didn't expect at all. I mean, I kind of expected it a teeny bit. Uh, but yeah, I am officially farther than what I did, got when I first played it, when it first came out, like what, four years ago or whatever. Uh, so I, if I remember correctly, I was actually in that hotel with Jackie and then like for some reason like it kept freezing or like something wasn't working properly so i never i never finished it but obviously now we are past that part and we are we just met uh was the name silverhand johnny silverhand uh but yeah that is it uh make sure you go and check out part 1 and part 2 if you haven't already i also got a comment in the last the first part cuz I am filming this before part two. Officially, right now, I am going to start um, looking around more. Like, keep an eye out for stuff because apparently I missed some things. Because I tend to mainly focus on the story. Um, so, I am definitely going to try to go around more. And try to, like, see if there's, like, Easter eggs or, like, any free stuff. Any special things or whatever. I'm going to try. I can't promise I will spend an hour and a half looking but if i'm around a couple areas i might look around before i go to the main mission that's what i'm gonna try to do uh but like i said the chances are i'm probably gonna miss stuff if i do miss something feel free to let me know in the comments what i missed or let me know if maybe i can go back or where i should go to find something i would really appreciate it all right Let's get into the game. Make sure you subscribe, turn on notifications, and make sure you follow me on Twitch. I usually stream on Friday nights and Saturday nights. Uh, so yeah, make sure you go check me out there. It will be linked down below. And yeah, let's just get going. That was a really long intro. That was about a two-minute intro. I apologize for that. But yeah, let's go. All right, here we go. Okay, let's do a little bit of looking around. Let's see, if do we have any more clothes, or do we have to actually buy clothes? Or do they just, like, unlock throughout the game? Okay, we do need to put some pants on. Cute. Oh, that doesn't look too bad. You can wear a mask? Ooh, a hat. Nah, <laughs> she looks like a freaking... Kind of like... She looks like a trucker a little bit with that hat. But that's a... That's a no-go. Uh, okay. So, no masks. Um, shoes. We have some shoes. Good. Uh, sneakers. Do we have any money yet? Um, how do I look? Um, t -t 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 money. Okay. We have $1,840. That's actually... That's a pretty decent amount. Let's uh, actually, before we do the story, let's do a little bit of looking around out there. Uh, obviously. Okay, we already did the clothes. Stock up on ammo. We'll do this stuff real quick. Alright, open, open, open. There you go. <clears throat> um. Done. I already put clothes on, didn't I? What's this? Oh, that's her little... That's V's favorite top. That is? Really? Why? Oh. oh my god. That was close. I almost forgot to turn the game audio on. I apologize. 
thank God we didn't actually get in to do anything yet. So I don't know why I do that sometimes. It makes no sense. All right. Open your inventory. Oh. oh, that's how you put clothes on? What? Okay, I guess we'll put it on again. I guess. Um, lower body. Pants. Shoes. Oh, these are outfits. Oh, nope. Okay, we don't need that. Uh, so we don't have a jacket. All right. Um, <clears throat> three guns. Nice. Okay, we gotta definitely want to keep an eye out on how to upgrade her. All right. Find something to eat. I'm pretty sure that's on the ground or on the floor. I mean, uh, or outside, outside. Oh, I'm sorry. I just got out of work. Give me a couple minutes. Hmm. How do I? Messages. Uh, rent past due. Uh, dear sir sla slash madam, a record show we have not received this month's rent payment for your unit. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't need to pay rent. Scam alert. Nah, that's not important. All right, let's go down. Should we take a shower? Sure, why not? And make sure that I didn't like take any clothes off. Okay, I think we're all good. Okay. Um, let's go down there and get some food and then Wait, so Is there food here? We must meet. Come to Thomas Diner. Hmm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. <laughs> Haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Hmm. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. I got Vehicles are bare. Okay. Cool. Thanks. So I guess we could have had food in here, I guess. Where, though? I mean, this is where the microwave is. Oh, well. We got most of the optional things done. And once we get on the ground, we will... Wait a minute. Barry, I think we gotta go there. this way. We're here to help. Uh, man, no, no, no fucking war. Hey, what was that? We came here as colleagues. Nothing else. Haven't heard from you in a while. No are worried. No. Now leave me alone. Congrats, Mendez. Way to be a prick. Oh, what? So I'm the bad guy? I'm not the one who's holed up playing the attention whore. He lost a friend. Can you blame him? He's not the first or the last. It's called life. Unfortunately, that is true. What's oh, we can talk to him. On? 
I live right upstairs. So keep on living, and stop minding other people's biz. Mendez, hold on! It's his neighbor! Is there anything I can do? Maybe. You know Barry at all? More or less. Struck up a convo once or twice. He's a friend from the precinct. Left the force not long ago. He broke down after his best friend died. We're worried he'll do something stupid. Relax, Petrova. Barry's got nerves of steel. He's just a spiteful old bastard. Mendez! Did you check in when he's chilled down? Too late. Sure, why not? Not like we're miles apart. Thanks. Nice. Just be patient. Cops falling in rough times can be touchy. I'll see what I can do. So do we just... Hey, Barry? Everything all right in there? I'm gonna take that as yes. <sighs> Try again later. All right, I guess maybe later we will come back and see what else. Hey, hey! Who said, hey? Bro, you look weird. You, I, uh, never mind. Let's move on. Know what the worst thing is about this place? The crowds? What the heck is, is no. the, are those tattoos? No fucking smell. True. Bro, I mean, it looks kind of cool, but like, Shum, you could boil shit I, I would not like me, full tattoos like that. Uh, the one thing I hate the most that, are face tattoos. You blind? If you have face tattoos, I don't mean anything bad. I just don't like them. Like, I would never date a girl or a woman or whatever uh, if she has face tattoos. Like, to me, I don't know. To me, the there's a few... Uh, spots that should never be tattooed. But hey, it's your body. You put whatever you want on it, I guess. Milf guard. Okay, what else does that say? Scan for discount. Mm, okay. <laughs> well. So, uh, were we going to talk about yesterday? It's all in the report. Oh, I read it. Except there's no mention of me telling you to delta the fuck out of there. Yeah, no biggie. Huh? Okay. That's my bad. I don't know why. I apologize. That's all me. Yes, you know what? I deserve this. Do what you gotta do. I deserve it. Yep. Almost there. So close. And drop. Uh, I said grab. I thought. I don't know. I don't know what I thought. I didn't think it meant grab him, you know? But hey, I guess it does. NCPD, open up. Seriously? Barry, we know you're in there. We're here. Gotta do this again. Are you fucking blind, yeah. gunk? What's so bad about personality readjustment? If you took a criminal, poked around in their brain to the right the old path. Bruce finished them off too quick. Better stretch it out over two more rounds. Hey! Me! Haven't seen you in a good one, two, few weeks. <laughs> Figured you'd skip town. Just trouble. Usual stuff. Ah, ah. In need of iron and lead, then, I take it? Was she recovering for that long? Sure. Let me see what you got. I mean, I guess that would make sense after getting shot in the head. <laughs> okay, let's see. Okay.
we're still pretty early in the game, so I don't really think we need to upgrade our gun like crazy. Eventually, we'll get a better gun and stuff. Right now, I think we're good. There's our favorite sign. All night, every night, Mr. Stud, okay. Oh, bottom, <laughs> bottoms up. How it feels to be on top, okay. What in the heck is wrong with this place? It's big. All foods. Sweet. Okay, I had enough of these. Let's move on. So, uh, are we going to talk about yesterday? Oh, frick, I got to find my car now. Oh, we got to pay that off eventually. I think we will. Oh, let's find the car. I forgot where they said it was going to be at. If only I was listening. Well, we found the closed door. That's nice. We'll probably check those out too in this video. Oh, repair dock, okay. I wonder if we can not, we are not allowed to go to Victor. Oh my god, where's my car? Okay, my apartment. Oh, some of them have fast travel. That's pretty cool. Where was it? Oh my lord, I just want my car. Oh, sweet. There you are. Beep, beep, motherfucker! Yeah, what the hell happened? Looks like everyone in this fucking town's out to end you. Makes me feel like an amateur. A hack. Ugh, shut up. Gotta find out why Night City's most courteous has upgraded to hit and runs. Probably couldn't stand you anymore either. I said, shut up. Oh, well, I'm in a pickle. Oh, thank God. When in doubt, crouch it out. Let's move on. Oh, wait, this is. 
Where did it go? Please accept our secure apology regarding traffic incident. I'm okay. Invite you to its main headquarters in order to accrue. To access damage and okay. So, how we call it? Okay. Well, that was fun. But okay, I guess we're taking this car. Definitely wasn't expecting us to get hit. I was so confused. I thought maybe it was like an N N NPC and like there was a glitch going on, but I guess not. Wait a minute. Mm, should we go there first? Yeah. Yeah, we'll do that and then we will go to um, a clothing store. Then we will probably go and do the main mission and then we'll we'll see. We'll go from there. B it's been a long time. Okako Okada, the lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well, you and that friend of yours. Until then. Already? Sure got that ear to the ground. Siempre. Anyway, you need something. You know where to find me. How the frick do I turn it off? Gonna go data crash on your ass. You oh, hear me? It must be going on everywhere. I'll run you out of biz. Would you be so kind as to give me your lawyer's contact information? Fuck you, Sirk Brain. For the record, it's gorgeous, but thank you. Processing data now. Please wait. No regrets. There's no shame. Uh, hey, doll. Hello, sir or madam. How can I be of hey, service? Hey, what's gotten into nice. you, Dell? Don't recognize me? You sent me a message saying I should come in about the accident. You are currently speaking to a Delamay network subroutine. Alas, my operational capabilities are limited. Could you please clearly recite your incident report? Don't give them any numbers. That's how they find you. Who? Um, 77 Incident report on file. Confirmed. 96 at the end means a public enemy, government target. Your identity has been established. Mrs. Elaine Pagels, what phrase would best describe your experience of incident number 77111101096? Actually a little heartbroken about my damaged ride, but I'd rather talk to the real Delamain if I can. V. My apologies if the receptionist was a bother. 
I'm preoccupied with the crisis that is ongoing, and I simply cannot oversee everything. I've taken the liberty of transferring a settlement to your account to compensate for the damage done. Ah, special treatment. Nice. Would you mind if we spoke elsewhere? No, for real. Sure, let's talk. Then please follow the drone. I'm fully aware customer service is less than satisfactory at the moment. Perhaps a guided tour will prove some form of compensation. This corridor links the shop to the office. And here is where the magic happens. The shop is fully automated. Mm -hmm. I'm pondering broadening my portfolio to include repair services. Alas. The shop is currently overwhelmed with work. Think I know why. I'm still looking into the cause of the Delamay network vehicle failures. My working hypothesis is an advanced virus. Hmm. I must resolve the situation quickly. This sudden rise in incidents is proving costly, aside from drawing unwanted attention to the company. The control room. I feel honored to have you here. Rather, surprisingly. All these lights, uh, what are they for? That's what I wish to discuss with you. A green light denotes a vehicle with which I am in contact. As you can see, that is no longer the case for some vehicles. Those are the red lights. Repair drones can't take care of this? This time, I fear, human intervention is required. Mm. I'm aware you offer a broad range of services and are unusually discreet. Thus, I'd like you to assist me in recovering my missing vehicles. Sure. Okay, sure. Why not? I'll go after your missing wheels. I'm pleased to hear it. I shall send you the coordinates of their last known locations. You must simply deactivate each. I'll then re-establish the link and return them to my garage. See what I can do. Delamain vehicles are exceptionally secure. Be sure to have a scanner with decryption capability on your person. Okay. So we just go and find his vehicles, I guess. Better be getting paid for this. And I don't have a car. Oh, there's seven of them? Where the frick is my car?
feel like this is gonna take a while. At least we don't have to bring him back to him, I don't think. I think he will bring him back to himself. Well, this is a big roundabout. One of my missing vehicles might very well be near where you are now. Thanks. Try to find it. All right. If I was a vehicle, where would I be? Well, that looks... I want to interact, but I feel like they'll try to shoot me. Better check it out. Yep, never mind. Now get yourself gone. Can't take it. It's too much. Huh? What is? All of it. The city, the bustle, the crowds. Okay, this is the it's one. Overwhelming. So let's get you back to safety. The garage. By driving through the streets. Well, uh, yeah. Afraid so. Fine. Take me there. Just get me out of here. Where you at? Let me know when I'm safe. You're welcome in, but do take it slow. And try not to hit anything. Going to die. I don't know how fast I can go with him without getting in trouble. Don't you dare. You almost dared. Enough. I need a moment to calm down. Great. Just great. No. We certainly can't stay here. Keep driving. Almost there. Slow down. My bad. So I think over 50 is when he really loses it. What, six more after this one? And I highly doubt they're all going to be that easy. What's that? No.
I just want to check this out real quick. Oh, oh, yeah, that must be the the fast travel. so bad it was horrifying but still i thank you you are welcome yeah so did i but the quality girl nothing like the original sincerest thanks for your assistance v i've taken the liberty to send you a share of your fee nice I'll take it. Alright, next is a thousand and four. Okay. Like we don't have to we don't have to do them all right now anyway, right? We'll only do the one right now. Because I wanna go to those to the the store. Then I wanna do the main mission real quick. Okay. Where is the closest we'll do the one that's closest to here. Collect reward. Oh, you gotta collect the reward. Wait, how do I get my car repaired? this uh, somewhere he's paid to go in how much uh I'm good Definitely not the type of club I would go to. You know what I mean. All right, we need a car. I wonder if we can fast travel over there.
Since they're not gonna let me call for a taxi. Yeah, I figured. Chill out, bro. Oh, magazines. Okay, they all kind of look weird. I want to. Oh, there's a kid in this game. That's weird. You never really see kids walking around in this. At least I think it was a kid. I could be wrong. You never know. Oh, there's a car right there. This is actually a nice car. Mama Wells. Oh, is that uh, Jackie's mom? V? Offer my condolences. Mm. Offer your condolences. Ay, Jesu Cristo, V. You lived under our roof. Have the decency not to treat me like some stranger you just met. Yeah, fair enough. I was enough. going to call you. I prepared an ofrenda for Jaquito. We can't let him go without a proper goodbye. The ceremony will be at the Coyote Cojo. Save me! Many of his I, I am, I'm will so be sorry. There. I'll be, no more, Mama Wells. I'll be there. Oh my lord. <laughs> I did not doubt this is why you should never talk on the phone while you drive. Prime example right here. stairs this way. Haha. <laughs> we have a decent amount of money, so we should be able to get something. Got any doorbuster deals on Yukatas? Please, please. Show back to big pleasure. Oh, here we go. Okay, you can get a mask. An armed jacket. Oh, that's a lot of money. Okay. doesn't look too bad I mean it has handles so that's cool <laughs> all right let's uh I want to check out the mask okay I hit the wrong button <laughs> oops I guess I own a mask now um, uh, uh, review the item nah, actually that doesn't look too bad I probably won't put it on though
I like those. Let's see if there's oh that probably matches it, right? Yeah, it might. Oh uh, I mean it does for the most part. What about this? Oh, that looks cool. How much is it? Two twenty two hundred. All right. Oh, man. All right. Now that that's done. Oh, we can sell this. Man, but we would only get $41 for it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where is it at? Oh. Oh, man. I thought you could put this under it. Guess not. That sucks. Guess I should have looked at what it said. Go we'll sell it. Uh, no. Alright, you know what? We'll check out another store later on. Okay. Is that mission on here? To go in... Go to uh, Jackie's memorial. Oh, it's two thousand miles away. We'll do the main mission first. Then we will go over there.
Sit. You do not look so bad. My thanks. Then, in the car, I doubt it you would survive. Thanks again. Appreciate What's it. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorino Varasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. Been thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Got no idea. clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure, but... She showed that slyness you get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out lumped with the outcasts easily. Or have you forgotten? Hmm. <sighs> Sorry, I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose. B, so. wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice? In Night City? I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think... They'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. So what, we stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain... Procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. Mm -hmm. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a poem. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. What are we looking at? The TV? everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. He what will did kill you, you say? I would be careful. You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. Huh. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. You're you're just lucky I'm here because <laughs> if not he would have put a bullet in your head. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. Mm -hmm. 
With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Honor and thieves. Thieves have none. There's just mm, honor, That's what I, I was just about to say. You're an Obu Arasaka degree? I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the Queen of Fixers there. Rogue. She take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. I definitely do wonder what 2077 will be I like. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you've got some nerve. First you're out to kill me, now you want to be my pal and make like nothing happened? You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. I like how a whole bunch of people started what looking. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You are the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you've had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What would I say to her? I got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seen your memories. Gross. Cool. cool. Very cool. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. People probably think she's on so many drugs right now. Since she was probably still talking out loud. We'll call Judy and then we'll go to that you? Jackie's Jeez. memorial thing. I thought you were gone. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. Know where she is? What'd I just say? Drop it. 
I won't tell you again. Can we meet? Let's Rude. meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Okay. You will. Name's Dino. Oh, no. Deal with downtown city center. V. Yeah, I know. Heard about you. Odd stuff. Need anything, you call me. Remember, Dino knows everybody. Almost there, so that's good. Mama, help! Picture me crossing my face and makeup. I'm painting with visions of prophets from the lips of the gods, set from the tips of the fathers. Table, we got to get rid of it. Really? It's pretty massive. V. Nice to see you. Oye, sit. Sit. You want a beer? I'll see. Nah. I'm good. Need to keep a head straight. No hay bronca. A lot of time has passed. How you been? Hanging in there somehow? Somehow. You could have come over for dinner. Nuestra casa es tu casa. Hmm. But okay. We put it behind us. Hmm? I am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda. There is still so much to take care of. Want to take part in the ceremony, but... Want to do it the right way. In line with tradition. Mm-hmm. But... Something I'd, I'd lay by his casket that would do justice to his memory. I... I don't got anything. But your heart... is in the right place, mi niña. Don't worry. He's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Thanks, Mama Wells. Ah, don't mention it, V. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. Ahí te veo. I 
Hi, V. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour. Sometimes two. I know it's gonk, it's just... I miss him. A lot. Wanna sit? Catch up? Mama Wells is having a send-off for Jackie. I need to find something he really cared about. Mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. Still too soon. No, it's not that. Mama Wells and I aren't exactly on the best terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things, disturbing the memory. Why? That I know. Jackie'd want you here. That's more important. Come on. Fine piece of metal and mechanics. Yeah. Can we take it? He was so psyched. Not like he's gonna be using it. Locked. Wonder what's in there. That's his lair. Slept there. He must have had a different key. Let's look around. Might be tucked away somewhere. Yep, that definitely looks like something who will have in there. Um, ooh. Well, that was easy. Found it. Let's do a little bit more looking. <laughs> Jackie loved to pump iron, didn't he? He called it his form of meditation. Oh, he got some creatine. He used to say barbells are the best listeners. They understand all your problems and never give you gonk advice. Oh, wait, how do I scan again? Aha. Uh -huh. Love to poke around engines. He was 15 when he first got on a bike. Knowing him, it is a miracle he never wiped out. Guess no man cave's complete without some of those, huh? He said they're collectibles. They don't print them anymore. It's definitely why they're up there, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah for sure. Still full. His favorite. Strategic reserve. No touching. How come? ¿Por qué no puedes tocar una reserva estratégica, va? Basketball signed by Dante Gonzalez. He was from Haywood, too. Everyone here shot hoops. Dante ran circles around him. I think he might have been the first kid to ditch the Valentinos. Like Jackie? You decide? Mm -hmm. They both wanted more out of life. Dante's captain of the NC Blackouts now. <laughs> This'll be fitting. Oh, we're gonna use well, that for the piece offer. You got something for your ofrenda, but we could look around a little more. Oh, Jackie, that a, a mandala? Mhm. Mm oh, it's a long story. Hey, you all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle, a home, the Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. It's we'll be nice. beautiful. It's Even hideous, though it's kind of weird. But it's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen.
I feel like it would be invading his privacy to look at this. Jackie, my man, you won't believe your luck. A collector selling a beauty in a condition. Price is good. If all go your budget, let me know if your interest is good. If you aren't, it'll go to someone else. This Saturday, the boys are competing for the World Heavyweight Championship. Beers are already cooling in the fridge. Don't forget about our deal. Uh, okay, wins by KO, yada yada. Hmm. Oh. Oh, is that Dax? I vouch for you and V. He heard about you. He remember you. Remembered you all too well, even. He'll want to meet with V, but I think it's just be formally. See you at the afterlife. Okay, that's the email Jackie told us about. Nice still. Typical Jackie. Of course he'd go for this one. Gotta be Jackie's dad. Old school ganger. Valentino's, of course. Did you meet him? Oh, I only ever heard about him. In an aquarium? Exactly, and he used to be tacos. And taco was? Miss Fish, a dwarf shark, like Minnie. Sounds Ooh. like a mighty expensive fish. <laughs> oh, I don't think he bought it. That makes sense. All right, let's go. Better get going. Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. You gotta come, Misty. Got a right to be there. I'd rather not get in Mama Wells' way. It's for family. You were family to him. I guess you're right. Thanks, V. You're welcome. So? Shall we go? Yeah, let's go. I want this bike. You ever thought you might leave Night City? Sure. Once upon a time, I even tried. Seriously? Meaning... Packed my bags and hopped on a plane to Nepal. Thought I'd stay there. After a week, I realized I couldn't live without the traffic outside my window and my neighbors hollering. I'll see you at the Coyote then. My deepest condolences. He was a fine boy. Then go raise a glass to him, Padre. A few glasses. De acuerdo. P. It's good you're here. We're about to start. Sit down, please. Hey, V. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was, or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Maelstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times, just by the heart. He was Dang. conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, No te preocupes, mama. Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. 
Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Oh, boy, do we gotta do a speech? Oh, Victor. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying. Make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true. Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Twelve rounds, buddy. Next. Me mandó Camporta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olor, ol, ol, honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? I, uh... I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. I'd been hired to drive him and some contraband across the border. He'd bought some goods, klept from Arasaka. Top secret. Priceless. A lizard. <laughs> and... And I remember what he said then. That... That I came from a place where... Everyone's family. So... He must be too. Jackie Wells. Always hungry for more, and never gave up. Not once. Once he set his mind on something. He was ready to die to achieve it. He... He once told me, Chica, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. For his loved ones, he'd sacrifice his life without hesitation. But most importantly, Jackie loved life and had no fear. Heart on his sleeve, he he didn't overthink things, he just went for it. Thought he was bulletproof. <laughs> and that he'd become legend at the afterlife. And ultimately, he did what he set out to do. Shit in the shoes of some powerful people. If he's watching. Bet just about now he's flipping him all the bird. A Haywood kid with a hell of a drive. Rest easy, Tomb. I would like to say a toast. Or mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words, B. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful ofrenda we gave him. A lot of people come today. Even that putica Jackie was messing around with. Her name is Misty. What? Misty. She was very important to him. Do you understand? Go. Invite her along for dinner. It's the least she deserves. Do you know what? You're a good woman. Jackie would want you to have these. Thank Please. you. I'll take such good care of it. Is it to the be. bike? Hold on. Okay, we'll talk to them, but I want to go see. Is it that? Is it the bike? I'm hoping it's the bike. Have a drink with us, hmm? To Wells? All right, sure. why not? To Wells. 
May he rest in peace. Good for now. Thanks. See? You gotta know when to stop. Ay, give me a break. Pour you another? For Jaquito. Listening's a skill, you know. <sighs> Sucks to meet like this, huh? Farewells aren't that bad once you get used to them. Have you gotten used to them? When you get to my age, friends don't come and go. They just mostly go. Jackie Wells. A proud son of Haywood. Mm -hmm. I should mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. Right. Lupe's been handling the loss pretty good. She's a strong woman. Ah. Oh, yeah. Oh, here we go. Now this is a good video. Man, Jackie. All right. Oh, I don't like the camera angle on the bike like that. There you go. That's a little bit better. I really love the graphics in this game. I'm wondering, how are they gonna make graphics better than what they are? But I feel it's pretty hard to believe that they can do better than what they have been for the last... Well, it's probably been about 10 years, kind of like this so far. Obviously, they improve with like how TVs are nowadays, and how good the console is. Who knows, maybe eventually they'll make games where they actually like are 100% like people that you can control that would be interesting but i don't i don't think they will like you ever play the uh the original Mortal Kombat game that was for like like an old fashioned arcade game like it had real people in it and like you actually controlled them so i wonder if they could ever do that again and that was back in like I think the 90s, early 90s or something like that. I'm not I'm not that old. I was born in 2001, okay? 2001. I just used to play that game a lot. Just had to verify. It's down there again, isn't it? Every time. Lose, this is like the second time I've done this. You mother. Oh, how about that? Huh. Well, that's one way to do it. Hey, look. Is that her? Yep. Hey! Oh, nope, that's Haven't not her. Haven't I seen you here before? Yes. Got a good memory for faces. We're closed right now. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She and her den. Yep. Take the stairs down. So you just, let Judy you know you're just coming. gonna let me in? Terrible security. I'm off the clock, hon. I'm off the clock, hon. Whoa, yeah, that's whoa, how you sound. Start again. Wait, they just said they were closed. That? Beat some sense into him. That don't work. I don't know. Use lead. I, I don't care. I just want my room back. 
your pimp threw you out, that it? Told me I was generating losses, then just said, have a nice life and slam the damn door. I don't got nowhere to sleep tonight. Still got your body though, don't you? Work it. Don't think I do. Poor health, okay. Every any I make gets eaten up by upgrades. So I said, fuck it. Got a doll chip. Went to clouds that they weren't hiring no more. <laughs> Jude is embarrassing herself again. Hey, where are you going? Nothing to see back here. Talk to Jude, you morons. Stop telling every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Of course not. Got nothing more to say to each other. Thought I made that clear. Or was I? Moxes and nomads don't seem so different. Both seem to yammer a lot about community, solidarity. Classic dilemma. What comes first? Family or the outside this world? This is a club. Nobody cares about your lofty world views. Listen. Have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Seem to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your Joombas killed like a real pro. Yeah, I mean, she's not wrong. You played your part in this fiasco too. Heist would never gotten off the ground without you messing in her BD. You two hazed me for fuck's sake. Both of you. She's not Whole wrong thing either. Stank. Said it from the start. Really want to pull the victim card. Can't see a single scratch on you. Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. Yeah, looks like it. But you're desperate. Writing's on your face. Okay, let's just say I'm pretty much fucked. Biochip we clept during the heist is killing me. Albeit slowly. Evie commissioned the job. I know how to stop that. That's why I need to know who hired her. Huh. Let's say I believe you. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. I'd look for her there. And where is that? Clouds. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Mega Tower? <laughs> Luxurious. Wait. Um. Just let me know how she's doing. Okay. Give you a call. Okay. Thanks. Thank you, V. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram and a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Riders, you're cruising at zero altitude. They call me Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No please to meet you? Hmm. I'm truly honored to meet you. What is with these random people biz? calling me that call I haven't even interacted with?
USA will perish! Wait, is this the main mission? Yes, it is. Oh, I'm really happy we got Jack and Sonic. Don't bastards to haven't said anyone to the person. Ah! The way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. What have I missed this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance Good. chick is hiding something. No coincidence, we already okay. saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Is that the only ad they got? Let's get out of here. You think Judy's lying? Why? Little something called intuition, V. Ever heard of it? So hold on. You take a blow up doll, remodel the hole, and attack cheat. That's Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? Oh, uh, sure. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. Mm -hmm. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. Afterlife. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Oh, we're gonna have to look for. So you got Sky and you got Angel. Two matches. Interesting. Is that normal or? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be, Angel or Sky? Uh, Sky. Rather go obviously. with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. Okay, how much is it? Oh boy. Ah. Uh. Looking for an Evelyn Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. I really don't want to spend $500, so. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I'm not a customer. Well, all the more reason to be excited then. There's a first time for everyone at Clouds. Don't dawdle. Well, this is going to nowhere. I'm sorry. She finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu. Let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. I think if we pay, we'll probably screw there it. There you go. I think we have to get in there, and then we might and end up talking to Sky. The payments maybe. come through. I don't know. We'll the see. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Thank you. Sad. We hope Go you enjoy eat a dick, stay. Johnny. Got 
guess that makes you a real deviant. The washing machine has a motor. Hi, I'm Sky. And you must be Valerie. Is that what V stands for? Oh, that must be okay, her name's Valerie. Okay, that's kinda weird. Well, looks like this will be interesting. So, V, you're dying. How'd you know I'm How dying? How did she know that? Deep inside. You fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. Asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. You're kinda annoying me. I was told this place would fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them and beyond. We are here to understand. So what is it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died. Now move on already. Time come to terms. just give up? Sure. Let me just curl up on the floor and wait for... Whatever. Give up. That's what you're saying. You're scared. Because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased. As if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different. People I've lost live on in my thoughts. And that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just an annoying little voice in someone else's head. You don't see death as destruction. The end. But as a change. This is totally not what I was expecting. That thought alone could save your life. I'm afraid of becoming someone else. Forgetting who I am. You're already becoming someone else. Every second of every day. Still, I feel a connection between who I was and who I'm turning into. What you really fear is becoming someone you don't recognize in the least. <sighs> so what now? You find out what it is you need to do. Which is? You gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. This is definitely Even weird. When you maybe should have. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you now. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Mm -hmm. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. 
afterlife. What's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? Evelyn Parker, what do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. You gotta help me. Please. I'm no threat. But she could be in trouble. Just wanted to talk to her, find out if she's okay. In case you haven't noticed, doll work's not the most secure job in the world. One day you're in, the next you're out. And maybe gone. Anything out of the ordinary happen here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Oh, okay. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where'll I find him? VIP area. Booth two, I think. Thanks. She has an attitude. See? You turned out to be useful after all. Not bad, but it would be. I can't get in. What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week. You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh yes, I am. No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you here now. You got any idea who I am? Problem. This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From At what I can see, no laments about your VIP that. membership it has been hurt. revoked. It Say hurt. what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're going to have to escort you outside. No shortage of white men. I'll say. Going back upstairs? In a minute. Where can we take him?
Oh, sweet. What will you have? Anything? You better keep this short and sweet. Hi. Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure. Uh, I don't have your details. Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. Need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Try calling her a bunch of times. No luck. Mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so... I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman? Who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kinda like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Mm. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. Chill. Keep calm. I'm looking for a girl. Okay, Cap. Interesting word choice for someone who plowed through, massacring all along the way. Things got out of hand, I'll admit. But cooperate, and no one else will get hurt. Starting now. Well, aren't you the queen of fuck-ups? You're not helping. Now what? Too bad you can't talk to dead people. Oh, wait. You're doing it now. Anyway, just scour his comp. That just might work. Broken Dow? Sold her off to a ripper. Chip was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toy's wet dream. We won't worry about the other things. Put 
괜찮아 Let's just run. I'm required to return your weapons, even though I'd rather not. Nice work back there. Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps? Think Fingers has got her? Think we'll find her there? V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. Don't have time to massage egos. I respect that. Of course you do. You'd have loved to drop an H-bomb on this place. No need to go so OTC. I've got other methods. Like? One thing's for sure, though. Claus won't forget this. Dying. You tried. It fell flat. Now you're flat. Don't look in any condition to find Hellman. Oh, like... fuck. What the hell's that? No, no, damn it. Jesus, the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. Gonna decommish before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. What? Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half-century-old score neat settling, and I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. I'd even laugh if it didn't hurt so much. Listen, I know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. Okay, so this Makoshi, what is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Following. Sure. <clears throat> That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Makoshi's linked to my ship problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are you? Fifty years that was rude. back. Ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. 
Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. Feeling a bit better now, so scram. Got something that important needs to One be. last thing. Alt Cunningham. She's the ace up my sleeve. Oh, fuck off. Tired of hearing your voice. Don't blame you, but you'll hear me yet. And don't get killed in the meantime, will ya? You give an end. Evelyn's not at Clouds anymore. Behavioral ship was damaged. Apparently they carted her off to a ripper dock goes by fingers. Oh shit. Heading there now, to find her. I told her to stay the fuck away from Clouds. Uh, Alright, later V. Alright, so that is it for this episode of Cyberpunk 2077. I really do hope you enjoyed. I tried to do a little more exploring at the beginning. I will probably try to do a little bit more in the next one. Uh, I think in the next one we are going to start off with going after the uh, all the uh, those cabs. We'll probably do that first. And then after that we'll you know see what happens. But yeah, thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe, turn on notifications, and I will see you in the next one. Peace. Everybody just do your thing. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. 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 Wake up.